how calm he is right now. Yeah, he's just kind of chilling. He's not doing anything but looking around, seeing what's going on in the neighborhood. You see how tall he is, though. He is taller than the large trash cans they have right there. Yeah, yeah. 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 Big mm -hmm. animal right there. <laughs> nobody got hurt, <laughs> including the moose. Yeah. Just kind of hanging out, right? We need to make a name for him. Um, uh, like Herman or something. I don't know. I think that's a pretty good moose name. I don't know if he came up with that on the fly, yeah, yeah. but okay. Yeah, a little improv. Yeah, not only does he do a good job coming up with things, he also does a good job with the weather. Yeah. If you like the rain. I mean, you know, right? Because we're going to see more of it today, that's for sure. We've been waking up with some scattered showers in the metro area this morning. Our temperatures have been holding uh, in the mid-50s for most of us right now. And as the day goes on, as you look at the planet, you're going to see a little bit of sunshine possibly and then we could get into uh, maybe a few thunderstorms so let's detail this this morning we're, we're going to see more of a misty light rain as the kids head off to school and then as the day progresses we could get a few sun breaks coming in here with the scattered shower chance around noon i think the best chance for a few thunderstorms will come in towards the afternoon hours and that will continue through the early evening i still slight chance but it is going to be there, and it's going to be similar to yesterday. Some areas could get a heavy downpour, or other areas might just get a light shower out of this. Highs today right around 62 degrees. Now, as we look outside this morning, 55, and those winds are calm, and we are mostly cloudy, even out towards Beaverton right now. 51, so a little bit cooler, but you notice the ground is wet. So do be careful when you head out this morning. It could be a little slick on your morning commute, as Carly says. Allow yourself some extra time between you and the car in front of you. So what we're looking at right now in the metro area is just some light scattered showers. The main heavy uh, or the heavier event is actually down towards the south, getting into the western foothills and the Cascades. So as we close in towards Oregon City, looking at Portland and Hillsboro, scattered light shower around your area right now. Let's travel down Interstate 5 towards Jefferson Turner and Salem. We're getting some moderate showers this morning. And this is going to be a pretty wet start for you guys because we have more on the way. Now, Salem, you're at 54 degrees right now, 52 in Hood River, and the Dow is starting at 54 degrees, PDX at 55, and Astoria right now at 52. So we have this area low pressure that's going to be diving south, and we have little pieces of energy that's going to be wrapping around that. And that's why we're going to see the showers continuing through the day today and into tomorrow. So let's time this out for you, okay? The morning stuff is going to start to advance towards the east. We'll get a little bit of a break, models are indicating. But then by the afternoon hours, especially if you get, we get some sun breaks, we'll start to see these showers redevelop again. Again, a few isolated storms possible with uh, some heavy downpours. As we advance through the early evening hours, about 7 o'clock, still looking at the scattered showers and still a possibility of a few thunderstorms. Overnight tonight, things will start to lighten up through tomorrow morning, but snow levels uh, drop between about, about 5,000 and 5,500 feet. Now, we're not really looking at anything in the way of accumulations there because the ground is so warm, but we still could get uh, some light snow on those grassy surfaces, so just be aware of that. Tomorrow morning, it looks to be uh, a bit of a break, and then the afternoon hours with the daytime heating, we see some more showers developing in the valley. So right around 59 for Seaside, 59 in Newport today, slightly warmer in Salem, and you Eugene with lows around 49 tonight. Wet at times with those thunderstorms still possible through the afternoon hours. East side, we'll see sun breaks. Temperatures right around 56 in Baker City. Also 59 in Burns with the chance of a few thunderstorms and showers. Through the gorge today, 60 degrees. It will be breezy. Government camp starting at four, or 46 for the high with a low near 34 with that snow level right at 5,500 feet. Here in Portland, right around 62 degrees with a low near 50 tonight. Still scattered showers for tomorrow and then we start to dry things out. I think we'll see some patchy fog going on Thursday. Mm. Check out the weekend, though. Warmer and looking good. So yeah. Saved it for us. That's Thank right. you, Riley. So <laughs> Thank you. Good news for last. All right.